Okay, I think we have to talk about the curriculum documents in science. I have to say that I think that these documents are the clearest of, of all the documents that you can find in school. And are, they are well paced, they have a lot of information, they make very, very easy the way that you can plan your lesson plan. You can grab a lot of materials from there and, and then the exemplar lessons are fantastic because many of them, you could even use them right out from the box. I love working with the curriculum documents, very user friendly. I can look on there and correlate my TEKS with the essential questions. It offers differentiation for all different levels of kids in my class, as well as some great activities and extra resources that um, I can implement into my classroom. Um, and it's great when I sit down with my team and we literally sit down and go through the curriculum document together as we're planning our science unit. It's a great document. So hats off to whoever's been writing them. Very user friendly and great. The CRMs are planned backwards so that we have the goals set up first and broken down uh, all the way back to the vocabulary words and they give you resources and it's a very successful way to plan your science lessons, to set your goals first, break it into manageable chunks, and the details come last. My team and I use the CRMs to guide our planning. The essential questions are great. They help me to make sure that the students are understanding the concepts and that I've taught what I've needed to. The engaging questions are awesome. They help um, lead into a discussion and introduce concepts. All the materials, directions, and are provided for the experiments which make them so easy to do. The CRMs make teaching science very, very easy. It is all right there for you.